Carla Renata, the curvy film critic. <laughs> Hi! I love your I wherever you are, I love it. It's oh, you look I where are you? I'm at home. So is that that is that a chair behind you? Yeah, no, it's a sofa. <laughs> I want that. I want the whole thing. <laughs> Kristen, you are but It's my taste. <laughs> Thank you. I can't stand you right now. Okay, wait. <laughs> you either. I'm like, what? I see everything. I want the whole, like, the. I want the flowers. I want that thing on the wall. I want it all. I love it. It's my taste. I love you. You are so crazy. You're crazy as hell. Okay, wait, girl. We're going to eat up my time in my interview. Okay, let me ask I'm you. sorry. I'm sorry. That's okay. That's okay. So, um, did y'all film this? Y'all filmed this during COVID, didn't you? Yes, we filmed Girl, it before you, the vaccine. Look, so how did you keep your vocal chops during COVID? Because you weren't out doing your concerts or singing, you know, on a consistent basis. She gets it. You get it. You yeah, get it. I know. You're the first person. You're the first person that asked me that. I asked for a treadmill for the 14 day quarantine in my room. I at, when I made my deal with Apple, I said, "Can I just have that?" Between that and watching 90 Day Fiance and practicing my song over and over and over, that is a fact in what I did. Sad but true. Um, I just, I did, I got on the treadmill and I did tribulation as many times a day as I could. Wow. Speaking of tribulation, how much fun did you have that? That was a lot of lyrics and it had that music man thing happening. Okay, Carla. <laughs> he told me, so Sonnenfeld said, this is how it got me. He said, we're going to do it. You've got this 18 pager. It's a powder song. You'll do some opera, but we're going to do it in one take. And I was like, like my hair extension fell out. I was like, are you? You what? did that in one Say, take? Are you? Yes, I did. Of course you did. Because you're Kristen Chenoweth. Of course you did that. <laughs> <laughs> of course you did that. Carla, I, was a, I was a nervous wreck. And by the way, on Thanksgiving, I was like, Jesus, take the wheel, please. I cannot, I cannot. How much fun was it? I can't. How much fun was it for you it. from Glenda? Because you usually play like really nice, sweet, you know, home wholesome girls. And baby Miss Mildred was a lot. <laughs> she <laughs> suffered no fools gladly. She was like, mm, no, and no, and no. And she, <laughs> I love you so much. I love you so much. Um, I have, I, really wanted to go there and Sonnenfeld said yes on the hair yes I wanted the maniacal joker lips um I used a lot of people that I may or not be related to um I held the bible upside down may or not we may have had a former leader do that um I did a little things for myself to first of all the way I view Mildred because I have to love even the even the villains or I can't play them I have right. to figure out how to love someone so unlovable. Right. And I, the way I did it was not, I looked at Dove Cameron's part, Betsy, and I thought, Mildred used to be Betsy. And it's what yeah. all's happened to her to make her so full of anger, hurt, insecurity. She has mothers against the future. I mean, once I read that line, to be honest with you, Carla, I was like, I, I, I'm in. I, I'm, I'm doing this part. I love the evolution of it. I'm th I thank God that we had the little red bow on the end where Mildred does when Cecily's character says, you know, you're kind of a judgmental asshole. <laughs> she goes, I am. I love that moment because I see change. I saw hope for somebody that's so wrong. <laughs> and that's, you know, I just, I loved it. And, and honestly, dear Carla, we wore cones. We wore these plastic cones like we'd been spayed or neutered during the pandemic between takes. And I was so thankful that we had COVID tests every other day. I was like, go ahead. I leaned back, take it. Let's do it. I needed, it was like water in a desert. Okay. There I said it. I needed it. The cast needed it. They're all my friends. We're all friends. We have all buddies and we needed it. What can I say? We needed it. And I think the world is responding. The people that are responding to Schmegadoon are responding to it because we need it. Yes, we do. Kristen, that is my time, but girl, we got to catch up. We got to catch up. I love no, you. I, you too. I, okay, wait, 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 wait. I just need to say something. Where, where are you living? Where is your home? Girl, I'm in LA. They go kill me. They're like, you got to. I don't care. And I do like, not care. Stalking. 
I like the whole setup, okay? I like the furniture, I like the lighting, I like the makeup, the hair, I like the whole deal. There, I said it. Thank you, mama. I will see you. You're welcome. <laughs> I hope so, because come on, this is a connection. Do I have to do any more? <laughs> I like Carla. I hate you, bye Kristen. <laughs> bye.